When I was researching for the book, I found it absolutely fascinating to discover through published scientific journals the connections between glutamate and a variety of different diseases. I, of course, started the journey out with trying to help my daughter who was then diagnosed with autism and trying to find the connection with why I seem to observe her sensitivity to MSG in the food supply and how that related to what she was experiencing um, symptomatically. I then started to research other diseases and so uh, for example like addiction, glutamate and addiction, um, our glutamate is a neurotransmitter that activates our nervous system about over 40 percent of our nervous system and how we learn different functions is neurologically wired with glutamate signaling throughout our whole body. Well, addiction is also the underlying mechanism uh, with glutamate signaling. So glutamate signaling is actually causing the neurological wiring to a particular substance, and that substance can be you know, alcohol or even our thoughts, negative thoughts, getting addicted to those. It's neurologically wired with glutamate signaling. So just imagine what that sort of issue that one is trying to overcome, how much more difficult that is if you have a bunch of glutamate in the food supply also, just completely throwing off that glutamate signaling. So i uh, love to do a series here to talk about a variety of different diseases. Um, maybe next one is uh, diabetes, um, but that's the underlying mechanism for glutamate and addiction.